What's up everybody? Happy day 65 of quarantine, I think. Just got a new bandsaw for a shop my buddy and I are putting together. The Jet JWBS 14 SFX. Pretty happy with it so far. Came in on freight, uh, on a pallet, about 300 pounds. They dropped it up in the driveway and we just had to move it on back. Just got it unwrapped and out of the foam. This is the base it came with. We have no idea how the fuck we're gonna put this thing together though. So the instructions are pretty much fucking useless. They say nothing except for that you need a forklift and or a hoist. Uh, we have no such device at our disposal. So it's really not that heavy to move, uh, but you definitely need a couple people, I think. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to probably set it up on something and put the base together. Should be no big deal. Yeah, it would be nice if they let you know you need a forklift. I picked this up for about a thousand bucks. It was on sale, 15% off-ish. So far, feeling really good about it. The other comparison was with the Laguna, and I think this is probably the right choice, but we'll see you in a minute. So no crane needed after all, no hoist. Just me and my bro here getting it together. The base went on really well, easy. I'm really impressed with how the machines were all, or the screws were all machined, really nice. Nothing, nothing threaded funny, everything lined up really well. A little heavy to move around, but all in all, not too bad. We were just able to use the styrofoam to lay it down on and get it, get the base mounted. But so far, so good. Really nice looking inside. The cast iron is really good. The, the molding and the release from the molds uh, looks really good. Uh, not a lot of hard edges. Bearings spin very well. Overall, really nice inside. Some people were reporting some issues with rust on the interior. Nothing like that here at all. Um, very good. Paint's really even. Yeah, so just got the table on. Pretty high quality table, I think. Guide moves up and down nicely. Not a whole lot of stiction. I think it was probably get a little smoother over time the way it's sticking, but not bad. Really nice, I think, to have the big 13 inch resaw capacity on this steel frame saw too. Very rigid, very rigid. Like a periscope. But yep, all the way up to 13 inches. Super nice. We're about to take a break, but we couldn't help but get the fence on because this this about wraps it up. Again, really nice. Like I think some of this uh, could be like a little higher quality, um, but overall, this is a really nice piece of aluminum. It's very nice to see that it has these two different modes. So you can run it in really nice for shorter stock, thinner stock rather. Yeah, but overall, feel, feeling pretty good about it. This did not take that long, I will say, to get all together. It feels like a real nice professional grade tool. Just wanna to note, like, it's really interesting seeing so much stuff come in styrofoam. It'd be really nice for manufacturers to use things that could actually be recycled or break down easier. I hate buying a tool and knowing that this stuff's gonna be around forever. Like, it'd be much nicer uh, to use like a high density paper or something and probably really effective, so. Note to Jet, consider the world and the ecological impact of your packaging.